I don't give a crap about that at all. Huh. Just uh, showing up. Where's it going? Should be yeah, this way to run up over here. Little chirpy noises. Stop it to our left, west, on a little rail right there. Little guardrail thing. We got a pup we got a puppet in the transformers as well. Right there. I don't know if I. Oh, I gotta shoot through the opening. I don't think I'm gonna get the arrow to go through. I think so. You mean to make any arrows? No, it should be okay. Should have drank water before I came in. Fuck. Should be fine. No, I got now. I got 15 right now. 15 wooden ones. Oh, I thought you were down to like, I thought you only made 12. No. No, I made two stacks. No, I make bundles of 12. That's what, what I got. What the with. fuck? You're gonna hear a lot of weird noises here. We have puppet in to our right by, by a tree. Closest tree. Mm hmm. I heard him. He dropped before you released. That's so weird. Well, before you saw me, really. <laughs> no, you were still, like, in the, like, the pullback, like, everything. It looked like he just had the arrow knocked back, and then he dropped. So, this is where we gotta be careful, because there's a lot of beepers that will make or break this run up here. Normally. Okay. Behind us. If I can if I can do this without shooting a single shot, that's a successful run in my book. Two are right in the bush. Two of them. One's up on the lead pile or the graphite pile. Oh, he's got armor on. I mean, if you aggro him, I'll just hit him with a sword. How did I not hit him? You did. He just did not give a fuck. Yeah, I only hit him once. I missed him the first time. I was like, I saw him stutter. Oh, there's a couple of them here. Yeah, they're gonna start be they're gonna start waking up around here. We'll just have to keep pushing. <clears throat> you got him. About to say, so long as he doesn't call a fucking horde. There's another one to our left somewhere. I don't know where, but I hear him moving. This is when we're gonna hear a lot of beepers.
I mean, this is the hardest part of the entire fucking run right there. Well, I guess that's good. Well, now we should be pretty much in the clear. I don't think uh, puppets really spawn in here. We might get one or two stragglers in here. So you see how it, the arrows point to server and control room? We're trying to get to the mm -hmm. control room. Okay. So we're just really going up. Yeah, we're going to the control room and then we're going to reactor. I think it's one. The react we're going to one of the reactors. And maybe it is server room? Let me check in here. I want to see what it's this for. Been on too many fucking prisons. I don't fucking remember which ones which ones which. I don't know if this looks like something. Is there anything in any of these rooms? <clears throat> Um, there's gonna be like an office building. There's gonna be a bunch of like office filing rooms and that's where you wanna go for bobby pins. Other than that, like there's not I mean you might find toolboxes in some of the maintenance rooms. Okay. Like there's some ammo in here. Like a single round of ammo. Ooh, good. Yeah, this is how you know we're getting close. You see how the Building's all fucked up. We're getting close to the reactor. I think I took the wrong turn okay. at Albuquerque. Control room four. Oops. Nope, this isn't the one that we need. But yeah, these little boxes here are a really good spot. Okay, yep. So, see how it says reactor three? where we're going. Okay. Reactor 3 near Control Room 4. <clears throat> well, Control Room 3 is to our left, right there. Like, both of them are connected by that little office. Okay. Careful, watch your step. Hide your HUD and just walk around without your HUD on. That's what I do in these areas. Look how fucking cool it looks. It is pretty cool. Especially with the little hazmat suit on, too. Oh, go into first person? Yeah. yeah. That's, I've been in first person this entire time. without. As soon as we walked in here, I turned off my HUD and just started walking. Close this. Yep. I think we should be fine, but... No. Understandable. And the fog is just intense. Like, the lockers over here have a chance of giving toolboxes sometimes, but just be careful if you're picking up clothes in this area, you'll kind of want to wear them. Well, everything, everything out of here basically has to be washed anyway. Yep. Cooling distribution room one. Like, I just ran about in a circle. I think we're going the right way. We might have missed the floor. Mm. Yeah, fuck. We have to go up one more floor. Back the way we can. Yep. Back to the stairs. This is the problem I have in here. I don't ever know where it is off the top of my head right away. 
I won't come no here. I won't come here enough to be like, oh yeah, absolutely, you know. <laughs> now to get to the building. Just remember though, too, anything we bring in here or anything that touches the ground, we're gonna have to wash. Oh, lovely. Same thing with. Well. So I brought a. Thing. I brought one of those radiation contain the co uranium containers for that. Okay. So we don't have to worry about the uranium uh, giving us radioactivity. I also did not bring a Geiger counter with us either, so... Well, just assume everything's radiated. <laughs> Six foot four. And pump two. Main pump react to three. Okay, yeah, we made it. React to three. If we follow this, we'll get into Reactor 3. Reactor 3, Reactor 4. I think Reactor 4 was the one that had a meltdown. So there are technically three places to get uranium in here, is what you're saying, correct? Uh, I think so. This Reactor is the one, main. Two, I don't. Well, three and four. I don't know about one and two. Because four's got a bunch of things too. Okay, so we've got these containers. <coughs> so now this is the fun. Have fun. I gave you. I just gave you a bunch of crowbars. Okay. So let's start with this one. Go with the least ones. I'll try uh, breaking open a few with blocks. <coughs> just once you get down to the good ones, just make sure you uh, get them before they get below twenty-five so you can turn them all the way up. Mm-hmm. trying so hard not to just normally what I do is I just remove my hazmat suit and lock pick but I'm trying to be good and not do that question is whether I can get this open with a crowbar that's under 50 you know 50 percent or less I don't think normally, I can normally so when I do it with advanced thievery and three strength I end up using 75 percent of the but because you've got better, hopefully it's not. Right. <clears throat> well, at 50% of this open, this crowbar is down to about 20%. I don't think it's going to make it. Well, it saves your progress, too. Uh, it does? Yeah, so it'll make you redo it, but your first, like, up to 50% will just fly by. So if you ever have to, right. you know, like, escape it, escape it, stop it. All right, let me repair this one then. Uh, you want to drop your bundles on the ground for me to lock pick ones, and I'll just keep trying to lock pick. There you go. Yep, you go. Open. 
Yep, and I got depleted uranium container. Uh, I mean, we could bring it, but probably just want to leave it. Anything else? My only issue with using these. Got it. Ha! Ah! Uranium. Nice. How big are these containers? Uh, you can't repair them, but you can hold. It's a it's like a two by four. The depleted one. Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> well, if we find some more uranium, um, well, ah, actually, where they go? One, two. They can hold eight pieces of uranium, correct? Um. Two, four, six, eight. Yeah. Let's. Okay. That's 800 bullets right there if we fill one of these up. No. Because it's okay. one one little charge of uh, uranium to make five bullets. Okay. And each, each charge has ten. So it's actually more than that. Good. About to open that one up. There's what, one more? Well, there's Almost one directly over ahead there. Of me. There's two right here. Okay. I think you're right. I'll take about 75% of this crowbar. Yeah, if you have somebody who's stronger, it's pretty good. So, like, that's why I've been trying to do strength training. So, if you have somebody mm -hmm. who's, like, I think the Fallout's, like, 6.8 strength or something like that. So, if you have somebody who's got that 6.8 strength or whatnot. Ooh, two from that one. I got, I got two as well. Yeah, that's... I, putting them in. I was looking at that one. I'm gonna put it in mine, just to... Fill this one wow. up first. Oh, okay. I ran out of lockpicks, so it. I was just standing next to you. Oh, you want <laughs> uh, bobby pins? Oh, uh, yeah, if you've got more. I got two. Here, take out bobby pins. Well, drop and drop. Then we need to take one out. I wanted to drop it. And drop that. And then if you want to yep. you want to take that <clears throat> container that's 100%, we've got it halfway full right now. Okay. I'm gonna go over, there's one over here, I see, right? Yep. Down. Tear that. Yeah, and if we get more than the uh, eight, we got that other one that's, that other uh, container. That's oh, good. I mean, we don't even need to technically do it, but it just, it looks nicer. That way people aren't freaking the fuck out, but I will be right back. Yep. making lockpicks. <laughs> I, mean, I, I do have an advanced lock. I have an advanced lockpick here as well. I didn't even realize it. At some point? Mm -hmm. It's only a 3 of 6, but... I mean, I'm 
pretty good at finding the sweet spot. It just breaks really fast. That's the problem. So when you're wearing your hazmat, you have red, uh, red lock picking. So mm -hmm. it's you break your picks easier, which I get, but I don't get. Yeah, we've been in here for 20 minutes so far, and we're already got a pretty good pull. I do have another crowbar on me as well. Oh, I got another one. Nice. This is already a pretty successful run so far. What's that? Five? Yep, we got five so far. Got it. Uh, I got one, and then I also got a 100% container. Okay. I just put it in the container for now. Yeah. <laughs> So is there anything else that drops in here besides these containers and uranium? There's graphite, which is only used for selling, but on these serve I don't know how much they're going to sell for on this. Like on Salvation, they didn't sell for much. Like so uranium- graphite has no other use, huh? Yeah, graphite's only used for selling. Uh, do hmm. you by chance have a, uh, have any screwdrivers? I've used up yes. all mine. Yep. Uh, as soon as I finish this, okay. I will drop my screwdrivers. I got two, so I got about 38. Well, I got two blacks and then three reds, so I got plenty. Nice. What's a shame is this doesn't count as any kind of strength trait. Does it here. not? Does it not give you strength? No. It used to. No. I have inactivity going on. And oh, stuff you like mean that, so. constitution. Well, and mu well, I also have muscle loss going on because I probably don't have any food in my oh, stomach. Oh, did you not eat while. before? I, I, I asked before we left if you, had, if you needed to do food. Yeah, no, my bad. Don't worry about it. Dude, two more. All right, we got a full one. All right. I'll put that uh, one in my drop, 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 and drop. There's two screwdrivers, or two more of those, and there's a gold crowbar. Thank you. Oh no, my hazmat suit's getting damaged. All right. Is there another one right here? Oh, there is another one right here. Cool. <laughs> It'd be nice if we walk out of here with some more. Get that all filled up. Dang, failed. You got no more bobby pins, right? Uh, I got no more bobby pins. Is that crowbar still on the ground? Uh, no, I think I picked it up. I was like. When you break that one, I'll just take a crowbar and then one of your repair things, so we got double action. Okay. Need another toolkit or repair uh, toolkit? Uh, probably. I just throw it on the ground. I'll pick it up. Thank you. Okay. Yep. Here, you're just wailing back into that thing, just hurrah! <laughs> Alright, 
Is this a crowbar that's only going up to 50? Oh, is it? I is that, is that the so. one that you gave me? Okay, I just want to make sure. I, yeah, I think so. I'll stop at 20 and just to make sure. Yeah. To make sure. Radiation presence. What's your suit at? Uh, 76. You might want to pick that up, repair that? Yeah, I will, as soon as I get this to open. Yeah, I think at, at below below 80, I think, is when you start getting ra radiation. I got, I got two more. Damn. All right, I'm coming to you. Pick up some duct tape. Thank you. Uh, uh, repair. Oof. Doesn't do much as far as repairing now, no. does it? That's why I said wait, we're either going to get really fucked or we're going to have a good time. All right. I got two full crowbars. I got... I'll Do just it 50%. burn this. I'll burn this one up then. All right. Oh, that's also why too. When you hazmat, um, you drain your stuff really fast too. So yeah, that was a good thing we brought extra duct tape. You want to drop a, another crowbar down? I'll drop a 50 percenter for you. Is there any more in here, or is that all of them? Mm, there should be some on the left side all the way at the end. All right. We got one. Put it in there for you. We got three. Oh, you already eight. put it in? Yeah, we got 11 so far. Okay. Uh, I think there's this one right here. Yeah, there's okay. that one, and then there's one over here in the corner. Okay, I'll take care of this one, then. You got enough toolbar or crowbar over there? I got a 40, it's 44%, but I've got two repairs, so I'll just repair them. Okay. I mean, ideally, if we can get, I mean, a perfect world, get four more, that would be great. I, I We could go to radi Reactor 4, just we gotta be really careful, because you get too close to the reactor, you just instantly die. No, not worth, not worth the headache, then. For what we got so far. Yeah, I mean, we should be good to at least get one. We just... You'll see when we get there. If I can find how to get there. Yeah. Just have to start carrying a box. Call it a hazmat box. And... Fill it with the duct tape and all that stuff. Certainly what what I end up doing, but I just haven't I didn't realize we were going to the the radiation area so soon. I'll have to start picking up duct That's... tape and that stuff. Oh I yeah, I got some in my crafting box, so it's not a big deal, so I don't really other than making um rain catchers, I have no other real use for it. Yeah, you have to you probably have to remake your rain catchers up on your place. They're at like ten percent really mm -hmm. i'll have to repair them okay i don't know i tried repairing yeah. them with the toolbox i don't it didn't repair so i don't know what they get repaired with that will be interesting to see if they can be repaired because if that's the case you only want to make one at a time one at a time exactly all right i got one here nice so we're up to four in this one. And there's no more over here. No. I got one over here on the ground. No. Yep. Okay. But uh, let's. Why don't we? Why don't we try to find the other reactor? All right, Try I'm against... gonna carry this up. I'm carrying this other uh, completed uranium container as well. The the hundred percent one. 
Uh, the 73. Oh, I have the 100 and the 73. I don't think you can repair them, so it's up to you if you want to keep them or not. <laughs> Just to make sure they we got these three right. They, do they sell for anything? Uh, <laughs> I mean, pick them up. Uh, I guess we can find out. I guess I'll pick up that one, too. We got that one. Did we get that one to our left right there? Yep. It says search. We got that one. Nothing in it. So, yep, we know we got that one. All right. So we're looking for signs for reactor four. I think it's up before. Mm, it might be this way. That reactor. Just taking a breather. Like... <laughs> Used way too much muscles. Now I gotta patch up my suit too. How's your suit looking? My suit is at eighty-eight percent. That's my last one. Okay. Use it now or wait, you think? Um are you do you have any radiation leakage or let's see. No, uh radiation presence is in recovery. Okay. D yeah, I think it's once you hit that seventy like threshold. I'm just looking around for duct tape right now. Mm-hmm. Also, a, a quick way to see if uh, something's got radiation, just right click on it, and if it says de decontaminate, that's how you know it's got radiation presence. Oh, that's interesting. These seeds don't seem to have any. <laughs> I, I think it's certain objects, or if they give you the wash thing, like if it's something that doesn't get dirty and it tells you to wash, I think as well. I think we gotta go up one. Just imagine if they added rippers in here. Oh, I would never come here. No, why would you? Be like, fuck it, the uranium's not worth it, boys. Nope, that's not where we wanna go. What's that's that? Fuck it. It's just a stairwell. It's a death trap. Get to reactor four from here. I wish there was like a map, like on one of these walls. Oh, kind of like the fuse thing. Yeah, like how the fuse, like the fuse rooms have the little like, hey, this is where this is, and I'm like, oh, cool. Okay, mm -hmm. so we hit that. May or may not. I have pulled up a map on my side. What does that say? Pump station. Are we able to go higher anywhere? No. Not here. We might have to go through this area to get to that other area. Maybe? Oh, well, the area you said not to go through. Yeah, I want to see if we can top off these containers. We should be fine. It's just don't go near the fire. Don't be like a monkey uh, and just run towards fire. I think it's over here. No. I. It's gotta be somewhere. I've, I, I've gotta find it now. Or maybe, you know, if I was fucking smart, like right here, oh, I can't see shit. That light's annoying. I'm just hugging a wall. Yep, this is it. Don't go near the big ball of fire. Uranium container right here. And then there's another right. one. 
Yeah, and then don't go near those little uh, magma slabs. And then you should be fine. <laughs> yeah, we might have tried to parachute into that, and it just, like, as soon as you get close to it, it just kills you. But yeah, I think we're doing pretty good overall. You want to use that that crowbar up too, if you're afraid to burn that one up. Okay. Because mainly we're looking if you can, I mean, we could probably end up burning all these crowbars. Hopefully with I that still, one and that I one. I still have one at a hundred. Hopefully with this one and this one right here, we'll be fine. We'll get to the, the threshold of filling two of them up. Okay, yeah. Do I have a filled up one right now? Yeah, you have a filled up one, and I think I have six. Yeah, I think you said you had six or four or six or something like that. Uh, it's at least six. It's more than four, I know okay. that, but I'm pretty sure it's six. Okay. Now that we're going out, I'm switching to full auto. <laughs> Notice we're allowed to have the. There's one. Good, 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 good. Yeah. Oh. Yep. Well, we have five. Now we have six. Okay. Let me pick that up. I'll start with this one and burn it. Where is it? This right there. Right here. Okay. So it's just these two in here. There's one right there by the magma and then there's another one by the fire but i wouldn't even tell you to go near that one that one's a death trap it is huh too close yeah just it's just too close oh. i don't even know if you can get to that one like obviously you don't want to touch the fire hmm Take a screenshot. Take a picture once we leave. Be like, yeah, putting Kuja to work. <laughs> oh, I figured out also how to mute the ch the global chat too. You did. So if you press P to open up your chat and then just click mute the little mute thing, it'll just mute it, and you won't hear, you won't get the notifications pop up until you open it yourself. Inter interesting. How close are we? Fifty-six, fifty-seven, sixty. 70, 80, 90, uh, when you open. get a moment, patch up your suit, yep. your uranium uh, container. Uh, uh, should be right there. It was just a... Uh, Uranium container. A uh, good one? 76%. Okay, so no better than what we already had. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to risk that one or do you want to just call it? Am I a risk taker? How's your crowbars looking? I have one at, a, one at 74, one at 50. Repair the 74 so you've got it at 100 already. 
I don't have any more tool oh. boxes. I you mean, know, burn them up, I guess. Let's... If you want. Well, we could. So... I'm just worried. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> it just, it's. Eh, no. Let's just call it done. Call it good. Yeah. Why is it leaving it? It's easier for me to see the thing, but walking in, I couldn't fucking see shit. Oh, because that red light. Probably. But yeah, that was a pretty successful haul. We got what? How many do you have? You have six? Six. You got so eight, so 14. 14. Yeah, 14. Yeah. So time to go make some bullets. 14 times 20 would be 280, and then times that by five. That's how many bullets we can make with the amount of uranium. 1,400, I think. <laughs> That's the amount of uranium we can make with them, unless it changes. Now, does the uranium replace the lead plate? No. It's just an additional thing. Oh, okay. So hey. it's, it's just an extra there... ingredient. Yeah, no, no, I get it. So, that would have been nice if it replaced the lead plate. <laughs> just a whole fucking year. <laughs> Radioactive fucking bullet. It also, it it's armor piercing, but it also gives you your fucking, you're also causing, you know, permanent brain, I, to permanent damage. I wouldn't, to see that I wouldn't care about, just so we didn't have to have lead plates all the time, because yeah. that's unfortunate, so well, you can only get. What I, what I was telling you about the other day, we should definitely look at that possibility as a substitute. I mean, I'm trying to jog my memory. Um, I know you don't want to. Yeah. I know you don't want to say it because you're recording. So, yeah, but we'll do. I'll tell you once we get we get out. Yeah. Yeah. Just going, t turning off your HUD and just walking. Oh my god. Oh, that's fine. I'm taking another screenshot. I'm taking screenies for days. I'm gonna leave this place and I'm gonna have a photo gallery. <laughs> So we should have just went all the way up right away. Yeah, start there and then work our way down next time. No, I'm just saying for the the pathing, we didn't go the floor. We went, we were one under when I walked out. This is control mm -hmm. room three, by the way. Hence the why it says on the side of the wall, well, control I'm... room three. <laughs> well, we walked past it, so we went into four. That's why I was saying, like, you know. Yes, I can be an asshole. I know. <laughs> Just waiting for the dad jokes to pop out. Oh, yeah. So yeah, we should have went up. We went into the server room. Yeah, we got it. We had to go into the control rooms. All right. So it's control rooms, not server rooms. Got it. Makes sense, but sometimes they be doing stupid. Whoa! How the fuck did you get in front of me? I walk faster than you. <laughs> So now's the fun part. The door. Get. So this this is the like obviously there's multiple ways in and out, but this is like a choke choke point right there. You can get on top yeah. of these rafters up there and just kinda have line of sight if you know people are in. This place is so fucking beautiful. <laughs> Start walking backwards. I don't think protect. We're running behind you. I got him.
Let's go right. That's him. I think he's, if he's on me, I got him. <laughs> or he didn't pop him. <laughs> Easier. <laughs> if I can see him, I can just pop him and that's that. Because I don't want to give him a chance to start screaming a horde at this point. Yeah. After we just did all the shit we just did. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because at that point, it's just going to be like, I got enough. I got enough. Uh, so these little stamina shacks right here, uh, you mm -hmm. can get duct tape and that stuff in them. Those long trailers are medical trailers. Okay. And they've got like, you can find a little bit of medical supplies in them. But obviously, unless you're needing it, I wouldn't recommend going in them. Okay. What we just did is like the the best spot. The only things really to go in here for. If you're coming in here for loot, yeah. there's something wrong with, with you. Alright. But yeah, that was it. Let me end the recording.